Hola chicos. Oh my god. Oh my, I did not just say that. You guys, you know what's funny that I said that? Because I was just watching our last video that I uploaded, the Spanish challenge. Huh? Ahorita. But if you haven't already, welcome back. And if you haven't already, please be sure to subscribe to my channel. Mommy, we're doing the 24 not, not anymore, puppy. We did it? Yeah, we did it, but you lost. Remember you, you were speaking English? So, but you can try again though. Puedes hablar español? Quieres hablar español? Yeah, we do again. Okay, go. One, two, three, go. So, yeah, you guys, Nathan's gonna be speaking only Spanish to us, and we're gonna see if he wins this time. Last time he lost, but he might might win. Um. So yeah, right now we're on our way to the mall. We're actually gonna go pick up some supplements because Sergio doesn't have pre-workout and like protein and all that. I don't like taking protein, I just don't like the taste of it. So I would rather just take in protein like with um, like food. So I just eat meat or whatever has high, um, things high in protein, I'll just take it uh, with that. But yeah, like I don't really like the taste of protein, so I don't drink it. We're gonna go to GNC really quick and then we're gonna head to the gym. Hopefully they sell a pre-workout that is safe for breastfeeding because I haven't been having like all this energy anymore and I it's need something. Workout. You get the energy but you don't get that. Yeah, it's different and you. I feel like you're more like motivated and more like you go harder when you have pre-workout in your system. So like coffee como que ya ni me hace, you know, it's like nothing so I'm really hoping that they do have something, you know? <laughs> I think it's so funny that Sergio actually got like... Like, you know how when your parents te amenazan y te dicen, Vas a ver cuando crezcas, vas a pagar. Vas a tener un hijo como tú. Está pagando. Bien corajudo. Is it nearby here? Today is Thursday, so it's another day today. Um, yesterday, we just ended up getting the pre-workouts and everything. And we ended up heading to the gym. And that's it. We didn't do anything else. But Sergio did get a lot of gold stuff. Um, this is obviously something that I cannot take. Um, this one actually says that it, like, it gives a warning and everything. So this one is like super bad. I do not even plan on like trying to take it. There's other ones that I'm like, hmm, maybe if I take a little bit, like um, since they're natural, you know, no me afecta tanto. But I still haven't got the balls to drink um, pre-workout. I kind of want to see a doctor to ask um, just to be extra sure, you know, because I don't wouldn't want something to happen to Bella or something. Um... Some of them just say ask a doctor, so I feel like those are kind of like not too bad because I mean it doesn't, this one gives like a warning you guys, so I don't know, but yeah, if you guys know of any pre-workouts that work for like people that are nursing, then please let me know because yes, I do need a pre-workout. Lately, I've been feeling so like out of it at the gym. Um, I haven't been giving it my 100%, so I need something to make me go hard again make me yeah go hard at the gym right now i'm just gonna have some, a little snack i did eat some oatmeal you guys earlier from mcdonald's but i think i may so that i know because my stomach has been hurting so bad and that's the only thing i've ate today so i don't know if it's that or what but i also have to go get a pedicure because tomorrow we are going to la banda ms concert which we're so excited about and tomorrow my mom is coming because she's gonna come and watch Bella and Nathan. So I'm excited about that. We have some interesting things going on this weekend. So yeah, I mean, I'm gonna have my little snack, which is probably just gonna be like a little turkey and cheese sandwich. Um, nothing too big, but I'll probably eat just like half of it. And that's what I'm gonna be having, guys. So I went to go get my pedicure and right now I'm making some broccoli. Um, it's like this recipe that I found on the internet. It's supposed to be for keto, but it looks so good that I kind of want to recreate it. Um, but I don't, I can't eat that much fat. So 
I'm gonna make it for Sergio and then I'm gonna make some for me. So basically what it is, is, and I'll link everything down below, um, like the website where I got it from. Basically what it is, is broccoli and like heavy cream. So um, you could also add bacon, but um, I didn't have time to go, to go get bacon. So I'm just gonna make it like this. If it's sale bueno, the next time I'll add bacon and I'm pretty sure it's gonna be like a hundred times better. But, so we're just gonna make it like this. Um, so first you have to saute the broccoli um, with the butter. Let me try to find a little ollita to make some for myself. I can not make it with antojo because it looks so good on the picture and I was like, oh my god, that looks freaking bomb. And I can't even try it, you know, but I'm gonna try to like kind of recreate it, you know. Instead of using butter, I'm gonna use a little bit of um, coconut oil or maybe some olive oil because coconut oil will give it that flavor. A little bit of oil and then this of course is with butter, which you guys know that's probably 10 times better. It's gonna taste way better like that. Um, so to saute it, let me go get my broccoli. Also, you could add garlic. So I'm gonna add some minced garlic to this, and then to that. And the minced garlic, I get it from Winko. Smells bomb. So you're basically just gonna saute it really quick. Let me just double check the recipe. So it's supposed to be this. So you add heavy whipping cream and you also add um, uh, cheese. So since I'm gonna use what I have, guys, this is not the exact. A recipe but if you guys want to check out the exact recipe then I will link it down below which I'm pretty sure is gonna be way better if you do it like with things that you know you actually need but I didn't feel like going to the store I was so hungry already so I'm gonna be adding some mozzarella So I'm gonna be adding some, and they don't. This doesn't really melt, but hopefully it does melt, melt a little bit, you know. So basically, they just add the heavy whipping cream. And then you add the cheese, and it should all just melt together, and then that's it. So this is pretty easy and it looks bomb, you guys. We'll see if it actually is bomb. With mine, I'm not gonna add heavy whipping cream just cause again, it has so much fat. But, oh, you know what? It doesn't have that much and I could add a little bit because I noticed I was gonna add um this crema that I have. It's supposed to be dairy free, but it has nine grams of fat. Per teaspoon. Okay, puppy. So if you guys can get shredded cheese, it will probably taste way better, but. Again, we don't, I'm using what I have. I was going to use this one. This is Dairy Free Sour Cream Alternative. And it has 
oh no it has a little bit less fat than that one this one has six grams of fat and this one has nine grams per two tablespoons and this one per one tablespoon so i'm just gonna add a little tiny bit then i'm gonna put two shots of vodka Obviously, you know, I'm not going to drown it like the Sergio's because I can't be eating this. But it already looks so good, you guys. Let's try it with the cheese. Taste test. Mm-hmm. Wow, this is freaking delicious. Sergio's gonna love it. I didn't, it literally took like two minutes to make. Definitely try it out, you guys. Um, Sergio's been asking for me to make different things. So I was like, let me look something up, like a side to make, you know? Because we do have like meat already made for like the past two days. So I'm like, let me make a side. And I literally, this is the first thing that popped up when I searched it up and it's so good oh my god i'm shook yeah give it a try guys and again if you guys don't want to use like butter you guys can always substitute with um with oils um and you know it's not too much fat don't put of course this much heavy cream you know i'm only putting a little bit no más para que agarren un poquito de sabor a little bit of cheese you know para no so i won't feel left out and um, still good Sergio, can you get the baby, please? Okay, guys, so Nathan's gonna do a taste test. It's a little hot. Okay, guys. I'm talking with the vlog. Did you want to try it? Mmm, it was a pipi. Okay, ya lo va a probar, ¿verdad, papi? Ahí va. Uno, one, no, en español. Two, uno, dos, ¿Qué? ¿Te gustó? ¿Mucho? Ahí está. Tiene cinco años y le gustó. So, ahora ser yo, ven. Vamos a hacer un taste test. You guys, I'm telling you guys have to try this. Even if you're not in keto, if you don't mind gaining like two pounds just from eating those extra calories. Oh my god. What is that? Something that I made you. Made me? Mm -hmm. Pues tú eres el de keto. ¿Qué te va a dar? ¿Cómo la cuchara con la que usas servir? ¿Qué tiene? Nomás es para ti. Está caliente. ¡Ah! From a 1 to a 10, what? 11. Really, it's good? No, it's not good. Not 11? You got me excited. No, it's not good. Es que eso con brócoli y mi mantequilla está bien bueno. ¿Sí, verdad? Sí, te doy un once, hombre. Ah, ya, porque ya dije. But, yeah, you guys, so they both liked it. And I liked it. So, you, now you guys have to definitely try this. Like, a bomb. Alright, guys, so I think I'm going to be closing out this vlog. Thank you all so much for watching. Let me do the post notification. Today's post notification shout out goes to Mariana Ram. Thank you so much, girl, for keeping up with my videos. And if you guys would like a shout out, all you have to do is, of course, be subscribe, turn on your post notifications, like this video, and leave a comment down below. And with that, I think I'll just talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.